Hello friends, welcome to my channel Doctor Online 24-7. Today's topic is Chikungunya Fever. Chikungunya fever is a mosquito-borne viral disease, characterized by an abrupt onset of fever. Chikungunya fever does not often result in death, but the condition can cause severe problems mostly in adults with other chronic illnesses. A person who has been infected once is likely to be protected from future infections. Causes of Chikungunya Chikungunya fever is caused by the chikungunya virus. The virus is transmitted by bites from female infected mosquitoes. The two species of mosquitoes involved are Aedes albopictus and Aedes aegypti, which predominantly bite during the day, although there may be peaks of activity in the early morning and late afternoon. These mosquitoes also transmit dengue fever, yellow fever, and Zika virus, both species are mostly found biting outdoors, but Aedes aegypti will also readily feed indoors. Outbreaks of infection are common and often occur after the rainy seasons when mosquitoes breed more actively. After being bitten by an infected mosquito the onset of illness occurs usually between 3 to 7 days but can range from 1 to 12 days. The virus is transmitted rarely from mother to newborn around the time of birth. In theory the virus could be spread through a blood transfusion although there are no known reports of this happening. Risk Factors Hosts with Heart Disease Respiratory Disease Hypertension and Alcohol Disease tend to have an increased risk of developing severe complications, such as heart failure, pancreatitis, myocarditis periocarditis, renal failure, hepatitis, pneumonia. If you are older than 45 years of age. Symptoms of chikungunya Sudden onset with high fever, the fever is usually above 102 degrees Fahrenheit and sometimes reaches 104 degrees Fahrenheit. Joint pain, joint pain is reported in 87 to 98 percent of cases and occurs in more than one joint rash and other symptoms may include headache, muscle pain, fatigue, joint swelling, nausea, vomiting, or diarrhea. The symptoms usually resolve over a few days, however some people are left with ongoing joint pains, which may continue for weeks, months, and even years. Diagnosis of Chikungunya To make a diagnosis the doctor will rule out other conditions that share the same symptoms as the fever. The doctor may also need to rule out whether you have traveled to or spent time in an area in which the virus is present within the last 12 days. The doctor may use a sterological test such as enzyme-linked immunoabsorbent assays, or ELISA, to confirm the presence of IgM. And IgG anti-chikungunya antibodies. IgM levels are at peak 3 to 5 weeks after the onset of illness and may persist for about 2 months. Viral isolation may also be used. Treatment of Chikungunya Treatment There is no specific treatment for the condition most people get better on their own and recover completely. If treatment is required the aim is to relieve symptoms usually with rest fluids and medications, such as acetaminophen and ibuprofen. If you are going to a place with an outbreak the following can be done to lower your chances of being bitten wearing bite-proof long sleeves and long pants. Staying indoors where there is air conditioning or screened in areas. Wearing a mosquito repellent that has DEET if you are going outside without sleeps. Dumping out or eliminating any standing water in your house where mosquitoes may lay eggs and develop as a larva. 
Homeopathic Treatment of Chikungunya Polyporous Panicola Eupatorium Perfoliatum Bryonia Alba Rustox Actae Spicata Arnica Gelsemium Belladonna Arsenic Album Ipecac Euphrasia This is all about chikungunya fever. Hope this video is beneficial for you. Thanks for watching, Dr. Online 24-7 by Dr. Sana Bawani. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe my channel.